doorbell. <laughs> okay. So we said we were going to do a room tour. Here we go. Alrighty. Ellie's going to do all her shit first. We're, we're, this, is, this is the view of the room. Are we zooming out? Okay. Yeah. A view from a short person site. Oh, hush. As you can Shut see, up, we have lots of things. Junk, stuff, oh. whatever you want to call it. So I should explain the design choice. This is kind of my room before Ellie moved in. So that would explain a lot of the stuff. And not much of a feminine touch. Nah, yeah, not really. So but it doesn't, it doesn't bug me any. Anyways, I'm going to start with the stuff that I have <laughs> brought into the room. Like the cat, kinda. Yeah, I brought the... Well, I didn't bring the cat. The cat's my fault. Anywho, I'm going to start with my morgue sign that I got from a stepdad. I don't know if you can actually see that. Yep. There is the morgue sign. And we're going to go over towards the band room. And I'll do that later. This is my do not enter sign. Yeah, it kind of is. And my hats. Get the cat. Here's the cat. Hi, Oreo. Yeah. You're a bitch kitty, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. I'm going to start with my main shelf. I'm going to start with my bat stuffies. There's a fruit bat that I got from my dad. A, well, there's a couple ugly dolls, but my ice bat, my batty from the Beanie Babies collection. What? Oh. And my ugly my other ugly doll that's mostly just an alien and I you can probably see the rainbow back there but that's that's my dick sucker anywho no it's not turn it around turn the camera around <laughs> no one's okay not my <laughs> <laughs> continue there's my cat gargoyle and yeah Betty Page cups, my Harley Quinn cup, and little knickknacks on top, and a rock I got from my dad, my dragon ashtray, and my crow flask that I got from Ryan. From Game World. Uh, here's my Harley Quinn pop figure. Well, I only have one, right? Yeah, other than so the giant one. Yeah. Um. Well, that's. We got the hot topic. It was exclusive. Kinda. Yeah. Got the hammer. <laughs> and we will start with the er. The Funko horror. The Funko random. mini horror figures, with Sam. Billy. Billy. Jason. Ghostface. Uh, a couple, couple random things I got at Game World. They're just Halloween themed cat knickknacks, I guess. Halloween Hello Kitty. Captain Spaulding. That's Sally. Sally. That's from a different one. Here, whoop, let's fix Jack there. Oh, you drunk? You drunk? Yeah, Jack's drunk. Uh, okay, whatever. Chucky, Hannibal, Leatherface, Myers. Myers. Ash, Freddy, and Pennywise. Um, other than that... Don't forget your, uh, Jack in the Boxes. Oh, yeah. I have little Nightmare Before Christmas Jack in the Boxes. There's the Jack-o'-lantern. Jack, of course. And a cat. Um, the Jack was broken when I bought it, but we fixed it. We didn't do shit. My dad fixed Well, yeah. Um, and then I'll go over to my other one. Yeah. Here is my bookshelf. 
slash everything shelf. Mostly just everything shelf. <laughs> um, I've got my Rocky stuff, Frankenfurter, VHS tape, and trivia game. Uh, the dozen roses that I got from Ryan that are dead, but I'm keeping them anyways. They're shedding. My fountain. My other Harley Quinn. Something uh, soft and plushy. Yes. My fairy. And I'll go down. <laughs> Shut up. My rubber duck collection, got a zombie duck, a pirate duck, vampire duck, and a normal devil duck, and a glitter duck. Yeah, but see, you don't have a ninja duck. I don't have a ninja duck. Or maybe you do, and he's just not there. Exactly. Um, I got a couple other pop figures, took out of them. but they're not in, box. in boxes. Got the Day of the Dead Jack Skellington and zero and my ghost kitty statue thingy that I got from Santa on top of my dagger that I will not show you just a pain to get out of there yeah um, DVDs I've got a lot not a whole bunch but a lot to me more pop figures I've got well, we've got Ash, Pennywise, Sam, Freddy, Jason, and Michael. Three. Uh, my Grumpy Cat cup. Hey, look, and there's a Grumpy Cat in front of you. Hi, Oreo. Look, I need to be in this shot. Baby. Nope. I've got a Michael plushie and a Frankenstein plushie. I've got a bat plushie that should be over on the other side, but it wouldn't stay. Cat plushie that I got from our friend Kathy. Um, a whole bunch of random books. I don't have like any particular genre. I guess they're mostly um, fantasy-esque, I guess. And then there's CDs behind the count. And my bunny, or what used to be a bunny, his name is Ishmael. <laughs> Call him Ishmael. And Hi. then my other random stuff. I've got photo albums, Monopoly games, The Nightmare Before Christmas, and Nintendo. And Excuse me. <laughs> workout videos. A book that I got from my dad, a ghost hunter's guide, um, a picture that I have yet to hang up yet, but I would like to eventually, um, and my yearbooks, and then the box to the Jack in the Box. <laughs> um, what else? I don't think, I think I'm done. Oh. Ah, a corner. The corner on the bed? Yeah. Now I'll go to my corner. I'm pretty sure you can probably tell which side is mine. Nope. Not at all. Let's see. Stuffed animals, video game stuff. It's not all video game stuff. Eh. Okay. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Alright. This is my moose. I got it from Michelle and Joey. And my baby blanket. I am not ashamed. These are Enderman, Candy Corn, a rabbit, a pig from Minecraft, Oogie, Jack, and Sally. Um, a hedgehog and a bat. They're both from Ty. Another bat that Ryan got me. It's the Minecraft bat. Not the Xbox yet. Um, monkey I got for Ryan for Valentine's Day, and a monkey that I don't know. That's my monkey. Yes. He's been up there for a while. 
but I don't know where you got it. He's from TY. Um, and that is my corner. Oh, and my cranberry juice. That doesn't count. Eh. That's the same one hasn't been there the whole time. I guess I'll take over. No, it, you don't need to stop it. Okay. I'll take over right from here, I guess. So obviously, like she said, that's my side. Why are you not focusing, camera? What's your problem, yo? So like she said, my video game stuff that's up there. I got batteries, rechargeable and whatnot. I got my Turtle Beach headphones, which won't be there for much longer. I believe there's a Wii Pro controller up there and a nunchuck that I swapped the buttons on with one of the white ones to make it my own. A bunch of different books up there. Stephen King, a bunch of rock and roll biographies and whatnot. Scott Pilgrim manga. The Legend of Zelda manga, and I don't care if it's for children, it's still badass. The whole Harry Potter series over in the corner there. Uh, I guess we'll go left from here. We forgot your rats, those are yours. So, a Wii U gamepad, which is The Legend of Zelda. Got a Minecraft torch. Wavebird. Collector's Edition. Uh, Wiimote. The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. A bunch of my random fat ass snacks. Got my tablet, my Kindle, and everything else that really needs to be there. My custom painted uh, Xbox controller I did myself with, I don't know if you can really tell, 9mm bullet buttons, a 50 cal center button, and metal thumbsticks. Uh, I got my bookshelf here with a bunch of random books on it and my stickers and whatnot. Uh, got the air conditioner. We've left from here. Flyleaf bandana, Volbeat bandana, 10 years, Poison, Aerosmith, which was actually my first concert, and then Journey, which is a show I didn't even go to. I guess I'll start over here. We got the mini fridge, which is empty for the most part. Got the ancient microwave that's probably killing us all slowly. Bunch of random crap up there. Can't really see too well, but I got my Enderman head, my Creeper head, and all my coats and a few of my hats. Bunch of model cars you can't really see. I got Sonic and a monkey hanging up there. I got this here, which is my collector's statue from Batman Arkham. I think it's Arkham Origins. There's a better light so you can see on it. It's the Joker with a bunch of TVs behind him. I uh, got a cup from uh, Silverwood, and we went on the 4th this year. Yeah. And then lava lamp, bunch of random stuff there, change. That's where I keep my wallet and everything. Comes some of my work stuff. There's all my DVDs. I have quite a few. Built the shelf myself. I'm not going to zoom in or take the time to show each and every single one. I got a bunch of Star Wars stuff up on top of that. Now we'll move to the crown jewel of the whole room here. So there's all my collector's edition stuff, or most of. Got Batman Arkham Asylum collector's edition, which that's what that came from. Some of the paperwork stuff you see back here. It's from the Arkham Origins collector's edition. That big box there behind all that is Bioshock 2 collector's edition. That's my Arkham City collector's statue which was our first date actually. Then I have this here which just came, I got recently. Red vs. Blue 10 years collector set with season 11. Um, it's all my PlayStation 1 games. If you have me on Facebook you've seen the pictures of these already. The only thing added to this shelf here at least has been Gauntlet Dark Legacy, Seven Sorrows, and Gauntlet Legends. One of the bookends here from the Mortal Kombat 9 Collector's Edition, which is Scorpion. Got all my GameCube and Wii and Wii U games there. A little bit of the Collector's... Well, not necessarily Collector's Edition, but little Nintendo knickknacks and mints and whatnot. What are you looking at? All my Xbox games. There's a couple original Xbox games in there. Mostly Xbox 360. Got my Halo Reach controller over there. And there's the other half of the, uh, kitty, what are you doing? That's my hand. Anyways, <clears throat> there's the other half of the 
bookends, which is Sub Zero being impaled by uh, Scorpion. Kitty, you need to move. And then here's some of the other collectors of stuff like Kirby's Dream Collection, which was uh, for the Wii. A couple of the other collectors of stuff. There's Halo 4 down there, and Halo Wars, and I believe that's from Halo Reach as well. Legend of Zelda, and Halo 3, and Fable, High Cat. Speaking of the cat, here's her small thing of her little corner here. Why are you hiding? Okay, so last of the collector's edition stuff here, I think, for the most part. Got my Halo Reach statue. I got the legendary edition of the game. And then my Master Chief helmet from Halo 3. Legendary edition as well. Got my PS2 with, I believe that's a Spam a lot sticker that I put on there. I uh, custom painted that PS2 controller. Um, got my GameCube controller with a couple extensions so I can actually reach from over there. Now that I have the wireless, it really doesn't matter. The Wii, obviously. Then I got my Mario and Luigi Wii motes, and then one I painted for Ellie. All the nunchucks and gamepad there. And then the 360, which I custom painted the faceplate of. And that's something that not a lot of people see. I got my Street Fighter 4 Tournament Edition Fight Stick. I rarely use it. I mostly use it to play like Galaga and Pac-Man to be honest. Because I don't play fighting games as much as I used to. And we'll move on to the TV, which is just purchased today actually. 32 inch 1080p Vizio. I believe it's an LED. 370 after all the extra stuff that I did, the Geek Squad protection and whatnot. There's the cable box and the DVD player slash VHS. There's the Wii U, which I put the Majora's Mask sticker on there because why not? And I got my Super Nintendo, my 64, all my Super Nintendo games, all my N64 games, and my NES with all my NES games, which is not that big of a collection, admittedly, but it's work in progress. Um, and then my NES I painted as well. I don't know if you'll be able to tell in this light. Oops. But if you look at it one way, it's blue. You look at it at a different angle, it appears red. You probably can't tell too well on the camera. But I did that. Painted that myself. You got my small collection of CDs there. And that's where my stereo used to be, but we just took that out. Uh, got a couple of different books over here. Game guides. Which if you don't think game guides make you a real gamer, then there's something wrong with you. There's too much to do in some games. That on the bed is also mine. Um, just a bunch of my beanies and a couple of different hats there. There's the trash can. There's always laptop and music stand that I letting her use because I have nothing else to do with it. Um, box under there has all my incense. Those random drawers pretty much have nothing of real importance in them. And I got my shelf here with the monkey that sits up there. A bunch of random bottles and glasses. Now the bottles that are up there are from memorable moments of me being stupid drunk or they're really special bottles. Like the Newcastle mini keg there from the engagement party. I'm not going to go there. <laughs> no, it's not funny. Stop laughing over there. And a bunch of random collectible stuff or just stuff that means a lot to me. Uh, got my Joker from Arkham Asylum. Another Silverwood. A couple different Silverwood cups there. Um, all of my movie tickets. Well, a lot of my movie tickets and all of my concert tickets are in that cup there. That's my dog Ramsey in that box there. A couple of different Legend of Zelda figures. Um, there's a little Tower of London statue back in the corner there. Alright, so that's pretty much this room here. A guitar back that I painted too. Um, so I guess I go into the other room, but I think Ellie should... Uh... So there's the little fat rolls there. 
Oh, white one there is Moo. Mr. Gray is Moo. The gray one that has her ass facing all of you is Richard, who's also an asshole. Yep. But, uh, they mostly keep us up at night because they like to do, uh, this thing where they jump on the, uh, top of the grating there and think that they're Spider Man. Alright, so I guess that means I take you to the band room. Which is what this door leads to. And this is where I make a lot of noise. It's my drum set. I don't remember what the model number is for anyone who's wondering any of that important stuff. Um, blue. I make a lot of noise with it. It's our makeshift microphone. It's not anything special. There's a stop sign that I stole from across the street when they were doing a construction. There's my Marshall amp. It's only a 30 watt. There's a guitar case that I built. I painted that symbol myself. It's a basic stereo in here. Um, and then there's my guitar. It's an Epiphone Les Paul, but uh, one that I bought it used at Guitar World. There happened to be an actual Marshall pickup in there, or not a Marshall, a uh, Ep the Gibson pickup in there. Sorry to all the musicians who I just made cringe. And a Seymour Duncan in there as well, well making this guitar worth about 300 bucks, and I paid 200 bucks for the whole thing. Then I got my Legend of Zelda sticker on there because fuck you, that's why. And I got my pedal here that I use. It's got a bunch of different settings in it that I put a mustache on because I can. Well, I think that about wraps it up. Oh, that's my closet with all my clothes. Woohoo. I think that about wraps it up for us here. Hope you enjoyed seeing our room. My fiance bent over trying to play with the cat who's probably just looking at her. You don't need to do that. So I guess that's about it.